City. Since the dawn of civilization, humans have lived in groups for safety, food, and shelter. As populations grew, so too did the demand for space and resources. Simple communities became villages, villages became towns, towns became trade hubs, religious centers, and places of learning. Those that continued to grow in importance and size became cities. Some have withstood the test of time, others abandoned or destroyed to the halls of history, while others were rebuilt to a new era. Each one has its story. Each one developed under unique circumstances, in different geographies, different climates, different cultures. Why did some thrive and others perish? What makes one better than the other? What is this idea of city and how does it shape our lives? How do we measure our quality of life and civic identity? Fundamentally, there are four parts to the concept of city. Construct, how we move through the construct, existing conditions and resources, and the human element, its people. A people of place, stories of architecture and survival. But who are these people of place, and what are their stories? Atlanta. Situated southeast of the beautiful Appalachian Mountains, Atlanta began at the end, the termination of the new railroad. Originally dubbed Terminus, it soon became Marthasville and finally returned to a feminine version of the railroad that created it, the Atlantic. Surviving the Civil War, rebuilding its identity into a new age, Atlanta sought to project an image of prosperity and commerce. Ever striving to project this positive image, city leaders, critics, and citizens alike have adopted and abandoned slogan after slogan. Capital of the New South, Hot Atlanta, Edge City, Black Mecca, The City Too Busy to Hate, A-Town, ATL, a curiously unidentifiable cartoon mascot named What Is It? And presently, every day is opening day. A city burned risen from the flames and rebuilt, hollowed out from the center, a city within cities, studied and observed the world over, a city of transplants, industry, and development. As it now experiences exponential growth and a repopulation of its urban core, it also faces challenges unprecedented. How many are aware of these challenges and the possibilities? What is the quality of life beyond the initial economic prosperity? How do we identify with the civic body as a whole? Our story follows four maps through past, present, and future. Architecture and development, transportation, natural resources, and art and culture. How and why did Atlanta develop the way it has? Who are its citizens and what do they think? What does the future of Atlanta look like?